Buckle up, fellow space enthusiasts, because we're about to uncover the celestial secrets that have been unveiled this year. From giant stars to organic molecules, this year is going great for astronomers. So let's catch up on all the excitement you might have missed in 2023. First of all, we've discovered some real astral monsters. Imagine looking up at the night sky and seeing stars that are not just big, but absolutely enormous. Scientists have been using a special telescope called the James Webb Space Telescope to explore the early days of the universe. And during their adventure, scientists stumbled upon ancient stars that are 10,000 times bigger than our sun. Yes, you heard it right, 10,000 times. These giants of the stellar world were some of the very first stars ever to form in the universe billions of years ago. Imagine a globular cluster as a massive cosmic crew, where each group consists of a whopping 100,000 to 1 million members. These clusters are like giant family gatherings, with all the stars being born around the same time. But what makes these newly discovered monsters so special? Well, their cores, or their central parts, are way hotter than what we see in stars today. Scientists think that this intense heat might be due to a lot of hydrogen burning at really high temperatures. It's like they're having a galactic barbecue party. Something fascinating happens in these globular clusters. The smaller stars crash into the supermassive ones and gain extra energy, like a power-up. But here's the twist. Most of these clusters are now getting old, and the supermassive stars disappeared a long time ago. We can only see hints of their existence in the clusters we observe today. Scientists study them by just the mysterious traces of their grand presence. The discovery of these monster stars is incredibly important for our understanding of the universe. If scientists can gather more evidence to confirm their existence, it would be a major breakthrough. It would help us learn more about globular clusters and how supermassive stars form in general. But that was only the first fascinating discovery of 2023. Although the next one is kind of sad. You know those beautiful rings that make Saturn look so fancy? Well, guess what? They might disappear in the not-so-distant future, astronomically speaking. NASA's Cassini mission, which explored Saturn from 2004 to 2017, gathered some fascinating data about the rings. During Cassini's grand finale, when it did some cool maneuvers between Saturn, scientists noticed something surprising. The rings were losing a lot of mass every second. Tons of it. That means this magnificent halo will only stick around for a few hundred million more years, at most. That may seem like a long time for humans, but in the grand scheme of the universe, it's just a blink of an eye. The important thing is that we've learned that huge rings like Saturn's don't last forever. They eventually fade away. Oh, well, at least you and I personally won't catch this moment. Scientists have a fun theory about what will happen when Saturn's rings disappear. They think that the other ice and gas giants in our solar system, like Uranus and Jupiter, might have once had massive rings too. But over time, those rings wore down and became more like the thin, wispy bands of asteroids like what Uranus has now. Saturn's rings are mostly made of ice, but they also have a sprinkling of rocky dust. This dust comes from asteroids and teeny tiny meteoroids crashing into the celestial objects and breaking apart. It's like a snowstorm of icy particles and space debris. The research also revealed that Saturn's rings appeared long after the planet itself formed. They were still forming when dinosaurs roamed the Earth. So, in terms of astronomical age, they're actually quite young, only a few hundred million years old. This discovery has got scientists all excited because it means something dramatic happened in Saturn's past to create this stunning icy disk. But this is a mystery waiting to be solved. Scientists want to figure out what exactly caused the rings to form and why they have such a breathtaking structure. Let's hope they'll figure it out. But moving on to something more optimistic, we have another exciting space news. Recently, scientists have been studying one of the most distant galaxies in the universe, and they found something amazing. 
organic molecules. The galaxy in question has a long name SPT041847. It's over 12 billion light years away from our little blue planet. Can you even imagine that distance? It's the farthest galaxy ever known where complex organic molecules have been found. That's why looking at this galaxy is like looking at something from when the universe was just a baby. We have no idea what this galaxy looks like now. The light that has reached us is what it looked like when the universe was only 1.5 billion years old. Imagine being able to see things from so far in the past. So what they found is something with a very complicated name. A polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbon molecule, or simply PAH molecule. You might be wondering, what in the world is that? Well, guess what? You can actually find these molecules right here on our planet. They can be in things like the smoke from car engines or even forest fires. PAH molecules are made up of chains of carbon atoms. And here's the super cool part. They're considered the basic building blocks for life. Imagine that, life's building blocks, those tiny carbon chains being discovered in a galaxy that's so far away. That's like finding a needle in a haystack. They also found out that gas floating around in that galaxy is filled with heavy elements. That's a big deal because it suggests that many stars have come and gone there, creating all these amazing elements. This means that this galaxy can be potentially rich in many other elements too. This discovery opens up a world of possibilities and raises so many exciting questions. How did these molecules form in a galaxy so distant? And since we're looking into the past, what could have happened to these organic molecules during this time? Could they have evolved into life? We're only scratching the surface of the incredible things waiting to be uncovered. By the way, if it's so far, how did scientists even manage to discover something like that? Well, they had the instrument called the James Webb Space Telescope. This fancy telescope was recently launched and has superpowers when it comes to observing the universe. So when the scientists were studying this faraway galaxy, they had a little problem. The light coming from those distant objects was so faint that it was hard to see or detect. But guess what? They had a brilliant idea to solve this. They used something called gravitational lensing, which is like a special power of nature's magnifying glass. Imagine two galaxies lining up perfectly, just like in a photo shoot. The light from the faraway galaxy, the background one, travels towards us. But on its journey, it passes through the foreground galaxy, which is like a giant space lens. And guess what? The foreground galaxy's gravity bends the light, just like a magnifying glass, making it bigger and brighter. It's like having a cosmic zoom lens for our telescopes. This bending of light creates a super cool shape called an Einstein ring. It's like a halo or a ring of light surrounding the foreground galaxy, basically a nature's way of showing off its magical powers. With gravitational lensing and these beautiful Einstein rings, scientists can see distant objects more clearly and learn amazing things about the universe. And thanks to all that, they managed to uncover the hidden chemical interactions from the early galaxies. Isn't that incredible? The scientists are beyond excited about this discovery. They never expected to find such complex organic molecules in a galaxy that's incredibly distant. Who knows, maybe this is just the beginning of a thrilling cosmic journey. So, keep your eyes on the stars, fellow space explorers. The universe is full of surprises, and who knows what other mind-blowing discoveries await us out there. Let's hope we'll learn even more in the future. That's it for today. So hey, if you pacified your curiosity, then give the video a like and share it with your friends. Or if you want more, just click on these videos and stay on the bright side.